Let's bring in our political editor, Andrew Clennell, as we look to the week ahead. And the Aston by-election is very much going to be on people's minds. Yes, definitely, Kieran. Even if it might be two or three months off, expect a series of attacks in question time this week on Peter Dutton's various statements over the years about Victorians, Dan Andrews and the like. The term basket weavers might even be used as the government <laughs> gears up for an Aston by-election. And what, what's your sense of what we should expect out of the Senate estimates? Well, Senate estimates all week, so the Senate doesn't sit, but you can expect the opposition to take on issues such as the government's lapse when it came to Nauru legislation, their changes when it came to temporary protection visas, Labor's support of the unions after donations from the CFMEU, and perhaps even Olivia Casley's story there on the secret Murdoch report on cybercrime. Yep. Good call. And on the legislation, we've been talking a bit about this morning, particularly the National Reconstruction Fund. Yes, well, the National Reconstruction Fund bill will be brought to the House of Representatives with the government a lot more confident of its passage through crossbench support. So uh, that'll be a big part of the week, Kieran.